गुड आफ्टरनून एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू महदी इंग्लिश स्कूल माई सेल्फ खुशबू धारानी एंड आई एम टेकिंग योर इंग्लिश एंड ग्रामर सो आई होप यू ऑल आर फाइन एट होम राइट एंड यू ऑल आर मिसिंग स्कूल डू यू येस आई नो यू ऑल आर मिसिंग योर स्कूल वेरी मच स्पेशली योर फ्रेंड्स एंड रिसर्स टाइम एंड फन टाइम राइट we all teachers are also missing you but today we will start our lesson okay today we will learn english chapter number 3 a day in the jungle lesson number 3 a day in the jungle so my dear students as every day i am telling you that whenever you are sitting for the study revision of the previous lecture is must why because the topic of the previous lecture can connect you to the present lecture so today we will revise first our yesterday's topic which we have learned so do you remember what we have learned yesterday yes yesterday we learned all objectives of lesson number 3 fair book notes right so today first we will revise that and then we will move to the today's new topic so let's start so yesterday first we have written hard words what we have written hard words you have to check in your fair book okay let's start <clears throat> number 1 jaya number 2 varun number 3 jungle number 4 parents number 5 chirping number 6 tree tops number 7 guide number 8 a accompanied now let's move to the next slide number 9 sanctuary number 10 pointed number 11 peered number 12 porcupine number 13 bristled number 14 quills number 15 spines number 16 canopy then number 17 camouflaged number 18 surroundings number 19 merge number 20 explained number 21 binoculars 22 leopard 23 woodlands 24 rhinosaurs let's see 25 calf number 26 thicket number 27 dagger 28 same 29 makan 30 langurs 31 ranger 32 pug marks then 33 sambar 34 scattered 35 adorable 36 frolicked 37 strength 38 fangs 39 remarkable and 40 happily so how many hard words are there total 40 40 hard words okay so let's revise what was the next topic we have learned yesterday the next is meanings what is the next meanings so let's start to revise number 1 peered number 1 peered so what is the answer looked carefully looked carefully number 2 bristled number 2 bristled what's the answer stood upright stood upright number 3 merge number 3 merge what's the answer mixed what is the answer mixed number 4 kill number 4 kill the answer is an animal killed the answer is an animal killed number 5 dagger number 5 dagger answer is a small sword 
आंसर इज अ स्मॉल स्वॉर्ड नंबर सिक्स अलार्म नंबर सिक्स अलार्म द आंसर इज एन अवेयरनेस ऑफ डेंजर एन अवेयरनेस ऑफ डेंजर नंबर सेवन ट्रैक डाउन नंबर सेवन ट्रैक डाउन द आंसर इज फॉलो द आंसर इज फॉलो नंबर एट पग मार्क्स नंबर एट पग मार्क्स द आंसर इज फुट प्रिंट्स ऑफ द टाइगर द आंसर इज फुट प्रिंट्स ऑफ द टाइगर एंड लास्ट वन नंबर नाइन फ्रॉलिक्ड नंबर नाइन फ्रॉलिक्ड फ्रॉलिक्ड मीन्स प्लेड अबाउट हैप्पीली फ्रॉलिक्ड मीन्स प्लेड अबाउट हैप्पीली सो how many meanings are there total nine meanings you can see here total nine meanings okay so let's move to the next topic which we have learned yesterday the next topic is give one word what is the next topic give one word which already we have learned yesterday today just we will revise that number 1 a platform that is built in a tree the answer is makan what is the answer makan a platform that is built in a tree the answer is makan number 2 a deep sound made by an animal a deep sound made by an animal answer is below answer is below question 3 a dark brown deer with branched antlers a dark brown deer with branched antlers answer is sambar the answer is sambar question 4 thin sharp spines on a porcupine's body thin sharp spines on a porcupine's body answer is quills answer is quills number 5 branches and leaves of trees that form a cover high above the ground answer is canopy answer is canopy number 6 an area of land filled with trees answer is woodlands answer is woodlands number 7 the young one of a rhino calf the young one of a rhino calf question number 8 a group of trees or bushes growing close together a group of trees or bushes growing close together the answer is thicket the answer is thicket so how many given words are there let's see total given words are eight how many given words are there you can see here total eight given words okay so let's move to our next topic next is fill in the blanks which already we have learned yesterday the next is fill in the blanks right so just we will revise it number 1 the children and their parents went on a jungle safari in a dash what is the answer the answer is wild life sanctuary the answer is wild life sanctuary question 2 they saw a dash bristling its quills they saw a dash bristling its quills the answer is porcupine answer is porcupine then question number 3 the guide was looking through his dash 
when he spotted a leopard the guide was looking through his dash when he spotted a leopard the answer is binocular the answer is binocular now let's move to the next fb next fill in the blanks that is number 4 unlike leopards dash and dash find it difficult to climb trees because of their weight and large size what is the question let's repeat it unlike leopards dash and dash find it difficult to climb trees because of their weight and large size so what's the answer the answer is tigers and lions the answer is tigers and lions question number 5 the guide was trying to dash a tiger by listening to the animal's calls the guide was trying to dash a tiger by listening to the animal's calls the answer is track down the answer is track down so how many fill in the blanks are there there are total five fill in the blanks 1 2 3 4 and in the next slide 4 and 5 so now let's move to the next topic which already we have learned yesterday this is the complete the following next topic was of yesterday complete the following let's start number 1 this was their dash this was their dash so what's the answer the answer is first visit to the jungle with their parents what is the answer first visit to the jungle with their parents question number 2 they watched the leopard till it was dash they watched the leopard till it was dash the answer is time to move on and leave the big cat alone the answer is time to move on and leave the big cat alone question number 3 they drove further into dash question number 3 they drove further into dash the answer is the woods and approached a hut the answer is the woods and approached a hut now let's see what's the number 4 question number 4 is suddenly there was an alarm call dash suddenly there was an alarm call dash so the answer is by a langur followed by a sambars below the answer is by a langur followed by a sambars below question number 5 mother smiled we humans dash question number 5 mother smiled we humans dash the answer is have remarkable intelligence the answer is have remarkable intelligence so how many complete the followings are there total 5 1 2 3 and in the next four and five so let's move to the next topic that is our today's topic let's see which is it our today's new topic is answer in brief answer in brief 
long answers. So let's start. Question one: Why had the leopard taken its kill up on the tree? Why had the leopard taken its kill up on the tree? So the answer is the leopard had taken its kill up on the tree so that it would not be snatched away by a tiger or a hyena what's the answer now let's revise with me the leopard had taken its kill up on the tree so that it would not be snatched away by a tiger or a hyena let's move to the next question question number 2 What did the guide ask the ranger and why? Question number 2 What did the guide ask the ranger and why? Answer number 2 The guide asked the ranger whether there had been any animal calls the guide ask the ranger whether there had been any animal calls he was trying to track down a tiger by listening to other animals calling sensed the danger of an approaching tiger he was trying to track down a tiger by listening to other animals calling sensed the danger of an approaching tiger so let's revise this full answer first we will read question question 2 what did the guide ask the ranger and why answer number 2 the guide asked the ranger whether there had been any animal calls he was trying to track down a tiger by listening to other animals calling sensed the danger of an approaching tiger so how many answer in brief one and two how many are there total two now let's move to our new next topic Next is all your favorite answer in short. The next is answer in short. Question one: Why were the children very excited early in the morning? Question one: Why were the children very excited early in the morning? Answer one. because on their first visit to the jungle question 1 why were the children very excited early in the morning answer 1 because on their first visit to the jungle let's move to the next question question 2 Why is the rhino's horn described as its very own dagger to fight with? Why is the rhino's horn described as its very own dagger to fight with? Answer 2 is the rhino uses its horn as a weapon when it fights with other animals answer 2 is the rhino uses its horn as a weapon when it fights with other animals let's move to the next question question 
what did the family sow from the makan question 3 what did the family sow from the makan answer 3 the family sow langurs on the tree tops from the makan answer 3 the family sow langurs on the tree tops from the makan let's move to question 4 question 4 is what is the leopard's speciality question 4 what is the leopard's speciality answer 4 climbing a tree is leopard's speciality answer 4 climbing a tree is leopard's speciality question 5 which animal can kill animals twice of its size question 5 which animal can kill animals twice of its size answer 5 tiger can kill animals twice of its size answer 5 tiger can kill animals twice of its size so total how many answer in shorts are there let's see it again question 1 then answer 1 then question 2 answer 2 then question 3 answer 3 then question 4 answer 4 and question 5 answer 5 so after answering short our next topic is make sentences what is the next topic make sentences what is the next topic make sentences so question number 1 in this ability ability so what's the answer the answer is climbing a tree is a very special ability climbing a tree is a very special ability question 2 visit question 2 visit answer this was their first visit to the jungle this was their first visit to the jungle question 3 intelligence question 3 intelligence answer is humans have remarkable intelligence answer is humans have remarkable intelligence so total how many make sentences are there three one two and three let's repeat it again one ability answer is climbing a tree is a very special ability question 2 visit this was their first visit to the jungle question 3 intelligence answer is humans have remarkable intelligence so my dear students now i will show you the whole presentation that how many things you have to write in your fair book so yesterday's already we have done so i will show you today's things today's topics which we have learned answer in brief so write in a new page new topic always start to write from a new page answer in brief how many two question 1 answer 1 then question 2 answer 2 then answer in short again in a new topic how many answer in short are there five total question 1 answer 1 then question 2 answer 
question 3 answer 3 question 4 answer 4 question 5 answer 5 so after completing the answer in short in a new page write a new topic make sentences make sentences how many are there one two and three okay so here the fair book notes of lesson number three a day in the jungle it's over completely ended i gave you okay so at last i want to tell you something these are the quotes of abdul kalam as i told you this is the end of the lesson so what is the meaning of end e n d end means effort never dies means whenever you are doing something do it effortly if you are failing in that so let's see the full form of fail f a i l fail means first attempt in learning fail means first attempt in learning so let's read it if you fail never give up because if you fail never give up because fail means first attempt in learning fail means first attempt in learning and end is not the end in fact end means what we are understanding by e and the end e and the end means the thing is over the thing is finished but e and the end is not the end in fact e and the end means effort never dies effort never dies and if you get no as an answer remember for example somebody is telling you that you cannot do this n o no means next opportunity n o no means next opportunity means you can do each and everything so let's be positive let's be positive so my dear students if you don't understand anything feel free to message me in my whatsapp number which i have already give you if you are willing to learn message me okay thank you bye bye take care of yourself